What's up guys, this is Massey, welcome to another video. In this video I want to show you how to find out the derivative of e to the power of y times sine x equals to x plus x times y. And we need to use implicit differentiation. So what we need to do, we need to find out the derivative of e to the power of y sine x with respect to x equals to derivative of x with respect to x plus derivative of xy with respect to x. So then we need to use the product rule. It's going to be the derivative of e to the power of y. Derivative of e to the power of u. If u is a function of x, is going to be u prime times e to the power of u. So the derivative of e to the power of y is going to be dy over dx times e to the power of y times sine x plus e to the power of y times derivative of sine x, which is going to be cosine x. That's how we use the product rule. Derivative of x with respect to x is going to be 1. And here, derivative of x, y. Again, we need to use the product rule. Derivative of x is 1 times y is going to be y plus x times derivative of y. So let's simplify. We have e, y times sine x dy over dx plus e to the power y times cosine x equals to 1 plus y plus x dy over dx. We move it to the left hand side. It's going to be e to the power y times sine x minus x times dy over dx equals to 1 plus y minus e to the power y cosine x. So dy over dx will be 1 plus y minus e to the power of y cosine x over e to the power of y sine x minus x. This is going to be the final answer. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please leave me a comment if you have any questions and I get back to you as soon as possible. Please don't forget to subscribe to this channel. You can have access to many other videos regarding implicit differentiation and other topics in calculus, chemistry, and physics. Thank you for watching and have a great day.